Hi everyone, today we're gonna look at the counter in Form Builder. Next.js Form Builder is an app, desktop app that is used to create forms for Next.js Mobile, which is in turn an Android application for collecting data in, in the field. All right, let's click on the form. This is form for Tiger surveys, and particular control we're looking at today is called a counter. So usually what happens, people are just entering route numbers, some other numbers to uh, in a specific text control. And they make mistakes, and this is not optimal. So let's remove that and add a counter instead. And the counter is more advanced control, which gets updated automatically. And you can set some rules to to, to fill the values in, in the country. So you might have a increment, you might want to set an initial value, you naturally with any field you need to set where the data will be stored, and then you can have a prefix and a suffix. And the prefix will be some value before the, the, the number, the actual number, and suffix after. So let's say we have a suffix, suffix uh, RT, and the prefix we will take from the list. And the list is another, another feature of a uh, new form builder, which is essentially a small table, which you can populate from CSV file, or you can construct right here. And then in this particular example, we have three surveyors, and each has a code and a name. Let's get back to our num counter and set the prefix from the code field. Save it and move it to, uh, to the mobile application. Here, here we are in the, in the Next.js mobile. Let's add this form from the, from the memory of the device. Here's a new layer. Let's edit it like we are collecting data. New, new point. Save. And then here, here it is. If you added the list, it will get automatically asked. You will get automatically asked, what, who are you, right? And so let's say I'm Bob. Let's say okay. And then the new form, uh, new record, will have a field called route number, and the counter will be grayed out. So you can't really edit it by yourself, but it's it's constructed the way you ask the counter. So it has a it has a prefix bb in this case, then it has a number and a suffix. Let's say we, we created this point and we add another one. And you can see that in this case it is bb2rt. So it gets incremented automatically. So your field collector collectors won't have to think about what is the next number or how should I put this route number so that it corresponds to some system of numbering of the routes that you want to have. This is all. Thank you very much.